What's up guys? Welcome back to the circus. Today we are in Marathon, Florida. We are going to go get Swordfish Redemption on our 36 Prowler. Stay with us. What's up guys? So we're off Marathon, Florida right now. We are in 1,800 feet of water. We are going to be daytime sword fishing. <clears throat> this is one of our daytime swordfish baits we're going to use today. This is actually an eel, uh, an American eel. <laughs> Refuses to let me do anything without him messing with me. Uh, we're going to have a, a, a rod that's going to be just standard off the side of the boat. And then we're also going to have the buoy rod that my lovely assistant is holding right now that will go on the buoy rod behind us. We'll explain the whole process as we get through it, but I did want to show you. <laughs> but I did want to show. <laughs> but I did want to show you the baits that we're going to use before we put them out. So we'll keep you through the whole process. Stay with us. <laughs> ah, son of a! <laughs> I was going to pay you back for the buoy. Well, uh, we took care of that one yep, early. Got that we? out of the way. <laughs> oh. That yeah, was an eel slap, like actually. That yeah. was an eel slap. Nice. That's a whole nother level. Nice. Uh, no, that's knock not. that off and hand it to me. That's absolutely not the first eel slap. No, that's true. We, we had a eel war, remember? That we will recap back Here, to right now. <laughs> Don't step on the eels, that nugget. Clear slap, you saw them. Wait, we've been two days trying to catch this one of them. Just can't believe it. Who put the eel bucket right in the way? I was up front eating floaty sap. Now that you've seen that ridiculousness, uh, we're going to continue and go sword fishing. Good call. Does this go out and go back in? No, we cut it. All right, cut. Jerry, we're almost ready on these baits. You got to make your loop. Say what? We're almost ready on these baits. All right, well, as soon as you're ready, we'll start. I'm just trying to get everything clear, you know. Like your head? Well, no, I'm not worried. <laughs> that ain't never gonna happen. <laughs> there ain't no point to that. Uh, okay, time for the swordfish. Whamma jamma. Woo! Woo! Swordfish, whamma jamma. Shoo! Woo! 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 Please stop, people are watching. Swordfish whamma jamma. Swordfish whamma jamma. 1100. So you see on these hooker electric reels, it's actually got a gauge to tell me exactly how far down I am. So right now I'm at 1180. I know I need to be at about 17 to 1800. 1400, Jerry. So what he did was he came back over the top of the line to collect all that slack and all that scope that I put out by letting it out behind the boat. So as you come straight up and down, Jerry, I'm going to bring this up to 1,800, and then I'll drop back down again. So look, all we're going to do is sit here right now. Now we're down. We're set up. This is it. This is sword fishing. So now we're going to watch the tip. We're going to take the, uh, we're going to bring it up. We'll wait up. And we'll drop it down. We'll let it hit the bottom. We'll let it steer up the bottom some. Swordfish like that. You know, they're diggers. They dig the stuff out of the bottom. They get a little jealous sometimes or whatever else happens down there at 1,700 feet. I ain't quite sure. But, so what we're gonna do now is watch this rod tip. And, and even though we're sitting here fishing in 1,800 foot of water, the rod tip's just gonna go boop, 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 boop. Because there's so much line down there. Remember how much we had even before the weight, much less all the other line down. So the weight's down, and then we still got all that leader out with the bait. It's out here floating with the lights on. So 
when he pulls, he's got to pull against that weight and move that weight a little bit just for us to feel it on the rod tip. So like I say, we'll be just going bloop, 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 bloop. And when it does that, bloop, 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 bloop. He's, he's on. He's on. He's on. Let's go. We're on. Pitch on. <laughs> I mean, he's not pulling drag, but he may not even know he's hooked yet, so. I really feel like I should be doing something more. Right. Get that harpoon ready, that Get long gap. So oh yeah, he's stopping the drag now. He knows he's hooked. Oh yeah, big time, all right. Woo! Oh, he's stopping the reel. Ooh, do we just pop him? We may have just popped them. I think we popped them. May have just popped them. Where are they? Mahi's Mahi, are Mahi, here. Mahi. Mahi's Mahi, are here. Mahi, they're decent. Oh, yeah, he's coming for it. And then rip it. Oh, they crushed it. No, on, the, on that motor. I really might be deaf from that one. Oh my God. All right, watch out. Here he is, Rob. I want you in the background. You got him, Jer? He's right here. He just. You don't want to give up. I, I didn't want to pull on that leader, you know? You know, and Jared, I definitely don't want to leave you out. Oh, I didn't want to leave you out. <laughs> hey, it was so good I had to get it on the boat. No, don't do it again. No, we're not. It's a fish slapping kind of day. Yeah, let's go. Come right to the swim platform with him. Keep going. Yeah, you got to come. I told you, it's super late line. Come right here. No. I was trying to. Get him in the bait net. Chris, you got me right in my right testicle. Okay, so everybody that watch that episode and say, you don't ever try to net him no. in the bait net. Okay, listen, you don't try to put him in the bait net. That's how it is on the circus. Sometimes we just lose our minds and just... No, we were just being lazy, and if we gaffed him, then there'd be blood everywhere. There'd be blood everywhere. And we do have a bunch in the box. Right? We got a bunch in the box. He was on. Right. 
Probably had him hooked, probably didn't have a bait in his mouth, I don't know, but he was definitely on. Where'd they go? But, uh, we lost it. We saw him pop off. Took a tremendous amount of drag, and then he popped off. So, I mean, you know, win some, lose some. We're gonna get another one. In the meantime, mahi heaven. So we just had a mahi beat down when we thought we had that swordfish on, which we did hook one, but he actually pulled the hook on it. So now we're resetting to get back on the swordfish. We got plenty of mahi. I don't even know if we're gonna keep any more, although I'm sure they're gonna want to. So we're gonna uh, reset right now and see if we can't get a sword down. Hey, Jerry, I'm at 1,000, 1,100. He has a fish on it, I think. What? Try to keep reeling past right here. He's down there. He's down there. Get the fish. Don't no forward, Jerry. Forward, Jerry. Forward, Jerry. He's a decent fish. I'm about to cut. I'm about to cut this line. Where's the harpoon? I'm cutting this line, Jerry. We'll cut this. Bring him on up. Bring him up. Get him off, keep him off the yeah, side, yeah. get him off the side. I got, I got, I got. I'm gonna unplug you for a second, ready? Coming around. Coming around this side. Around, around. That leader, dude. I got you, I got you. Go over here, Rob. Yep. Keep going. Come on. What's up, guys? What's up? Come I on. Just plug it back in, I just plug it back in. Hey, Frank, he's coming back to the motors. I got it, Shorty. Hey, Frank, it. I got him on the rope, I got him on the rope. Chris is gonna pop his head right here, you're gonna stick him. Stick him! Stick him, Chris. Stick him! You gotta stick him, Chris. Stick him! Harpoon him! Stick him! No, I don't need the harpoon, I can do it again, hang on. Watch this, watch this, guys, watch it. Oh, wait, Gaff? Yep. Go ahead and put it in. Put it in there. You see 47 inches? Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's way bigger than the last one. He went deep. Yeah! 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 yeah. yeah. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. Anybody get underwater? Yeah, I did a little bit, yeah. Ready, Clint? Okay, careful, guys. Careful, careful, careful. Do eat peanuts. Elephants definitely eat peanuts. It looks like a sand deal to me, yeah. but yeah. that just came shooting out of his mouth. We'll cut his stomach up yeah, later. We're not really sure exactly them. what it is, but we would call it a sand deal, but it's it's not. These are the immortal words of Jerry. Elephants eat peanuts. Elephants eat peanuts. And just awesome, fantastically awesome. You got so, some fish slaps, which I was excited about. We did get some fish slaps. Mm -hmm. Oh, I forgot about those. Eel, eel slap. I forgot about yeah, eel, slap. Eel, yeah. slap. eel slap. I got a eel slap. I forgot about yeah. that. How'd that taste? So who owes who slaps now? I always get them, so I don't owe anybody anything. I'm staying neutral. I'm, yeah, I'm I think Swiss. I'm even. So I owe everybody. 
Not me. I never slapped you. No, once. not you. No, I never will slap you, Rob. Oh, thank you. But everybody else, I'll right. slap them. All right, good. He's setting, All right. He's setting you We're up. We're going to run it around, so you might want to go right. Huh? <laughs> All right, We're about here. to be on the beach. Hey, look, really, so let's wrap it on up here, guys. We loved, we loved having y'all with us today. Uh, make sure you subscribe and uh, like. And like, and like us. Comment. <laughs> comment and comment, okay? Do all the things you're supposed to do. You know what you're supposed to do. All right, we're going to see y'all next time. All right, here you go, boys. One, two, three. Circus! Circus!